No, my credit score is not 300. I'll show you what it is later on in this video. But someone did come to me a few weeks back for help and his credit score was just a tad above that. Let's just say we have a lot of work to do. So one of the first questions he asked me, besides how do I increase my credit score, is this. What's the difference between my credit score and my credit report? And that, that's what I'll be answering today because your credit score, your credit report, your credit history impacts more of your life than you think. This is what many of our clients, as well as the students in our newly reopened Millionaire Masters course are discovering right now as they work on building their credit and refinancing existing debt. Plus, I'll tell you which credit score is the most important and what your banks and lenders use this information for. And the five major companies that have their sticky fingers in your credit, FICO, Vantage, Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax. What role do they play when it comes to your credit? Hey guys, it's Jennifer Diamond Estate, where we talk all about money and your millionaire journey. Think of your credit score like a grade you get in school and your credit report as your report card. That's basically what your credit scores and your credit reports are to your lenders, to the banks, credit card companies, and other companies that you borrow money from. Your credit scores and credit reports tell your lenders how worthy you are of borrowing their money and how likely you are to pay that money back to them on time. As a rule of thumb, the better your credit score, the better the interest rate that you'll get from your lenders, which means the less you'll need to shell out to them in the long run. Having a poor or mediocre credit score affects the interest rate you have to pay for almost everything. It can affect your ability to refinance your student loans, buy your first home, and even to rent an apartment or land a new job. So it's important for you to understand what impacts your credit scores and what to look out for on your credit report. You'll notice I keep saying credit scores. That's because there's more than one credit score. You might have a FICO score, an Equifax score, an Experian score, a TransUnion score, a Vantage score, or some combination of the five, possibly even all five if you have been using credit cards and borrowing for some time. Let's start with your FICO score, because that's what 90% of your lenders use when deciding whether or not to approve you for a loan or credit card. They also use your FICO score to determine the interest rate they'll charge you on that loan or credit card. FICO, which stands for Fair Isaac and Company, is an independently owned analytics company that just calculates your credit scores for banks and other lenders. Vantage is similar to FICO in that it also calculates your credit scores for banks and other lenders but it is not independent like FICO. Vantage is owned by Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion. In fact, the Vantage score was created by Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion in 2006 as a means of competing with FICO. The Vantage score has gained popularity in recent years amongst financial institutions. Many of the free personal finance apps use the Vantage score. So when you log on to mint.com, for example, the credit score you're seeing is your Vantage score. But Vantage still has a very, very long way to go before it catches up to FICO, if it ever catches up to FICO. So FICO and Vantage just calculate your credit score. Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion, these three companies also calculate your credit score, but they do more than just that. In addition to calculating your credit scores, Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion also analyze your borrowing habits and create credit reports that show the debt that you owe and how you manage that debt. For example, do you pay on time? Do you pay your balance in full every month? Credit reports are a big part of the Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion business, unlike with FICO and Vantage, which don't do this at all. And that's why Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion are known as the three credit reporting agencies, the three credit bureaus. When you apply for a new credit card or loan, your lender typically looks at your FICO score as well as credit information provided by at least one, sometimes two, of the credit reporting agencies before deciding whether or not to lend you money. And what you'll generally find is that your credit scores across the five companies 
FICO Vantage, Equifax Experian, and TransUnion will be in a similar range, but they will not be the same because each of these companies has a slightly different way of calculating your scores. It's not uncommon to find a 100 point difference between your lowest and your highest credit score. So if you take my credit scores, for example, my FICO score is 811 and my Vantage score is 726. That's an 85 point difference between my highest and my lowest credit score. My TransUnion score is coincidentally also 726 and my Equifax score is 741. I'm not really worried about the differences across the scores for two reasons. One, this difference between my credit scores is roughly the same every month. Sometimes it's a 60 point difference, sometimes 70, sometimes more. Now, if I had more than a hundred point difference, then I might start asking questions, but an 85 point difference I'm still comfortable with. Two, all these credit scores are in similar credit categories. So either good, very good, or excellent. If all my scores were good, very good, or excellent, and all of a sudden I got one that was out of these ranges, then I'd also have to start looking into it. Guys, if you like what you've seen so far, don't forget to give that thumbs up and subscribe a gentle tap. This tells me that we're putting out the right stuff for you and your millionaire journey. Now, if you're thinking, how do I get credit scores like Jennifer's or even better ones for that matter? Drop me a note at jenniferdiamondestic.com to see if I can help you reach your financial goals faster this year. Or check out our newly reopened Millionaire Masters course via the link below and kick off your millionaire journey with us today. If you're watching this in January, you're one of the lucky ones to grab Millionaire Masters at its reopening price. Otherwise, no sweat, I've included our YouTube discount code below for you. If on the other hand, you wanna give things a shot on your own, then be sure to check out our videos here on boosting your credit score and paying off debt. You can get a free copy of your Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion credit report every year from annualcreditreport.com or directly from the credit bureaus themselves. I've included all the links below. Once you have your credit report, you'll see all the debts that you owe and who you owe them to. If you come across inaccurate information on your credit report, such as an incorrect name, address, balance, or reported late payment, it's important to fix it right away. Disputes can be filed directly with the credit bureau, with Equifax, Experian, or TransUnion, or with the bank reporting the information. Credit Karma also lets you do this through their website via a quick, straightforward dispute process. In the event that you discover fraudulent accounts opened in your name, you should file a police report with your local police station and then send a copy of the report to the credit bureaus along with a letter explaining the fraudulent account. You should also file an identity theft report with the FTC, the Federal Trade Commission. I've included their link below as well. So go ahead now and get your free credit reports, make sure that everything is correct and update anything that is not correct. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you're still here and you really want to get serious about hitting some major money milestones this year, then shoot me a note at jennifer at diamondestic.com to see how it can help you speed things up. I'll see you again next week with another money saving wealth building video for your millionaire journey.